Hello guys, this is Paul here, and thank you for joining me back in another Minecraft video. <laughs> so this is another challenge video, and as you can see from the world name here and the title of this video, this is the ore challenge. So essentially, we're going to collect ore. So let's jump into this, and we'll explain more about it. Uh, so of course, we're on survival. We've got difficulty on normal. Let's just set my texture pack actually to the natural one, which is the one I tend to use. And uh, we've got a random seed and uh, um, yeah random seed I'm also gonna have a bonus chest basically and of course we're gonna generate structures because you know if there's any structures um, get generated then that could help us out so let's create this new world so basically I'm not starting with anything in this other than what's in the bonus chest now that could be nothing uh, could be nothing useful but it might have some uh, things in there that could come in handy so essentially the ore challenge what is that then <laughs> as you can imagine it is we've got to collect ore we've got to collect um basically each type of thing so we should have a bonus chest around here and where is that <laughs> oh here we go nice right so we got some i mean we've got saplings we don't really need these we've got potatoes apples right, we've got an axe right so we've got a good amount of food to start us off with that's pretty cool don't really need the map too much here. Uh, so let's get rid of some of these things we don't need straight away. I'm not really going to need the saplings, am I really, to, in all honesty, um, when we think about it. So yeah, um, so obviously the ores I need to collect, I need to collect coal, iron, gold, redstone, lapis and diamonds. And as a bonus, we can go ahead and try and collect uh, emeralds now that i've not set that as a definite goal because emeralds are quite rare but the only thing i've sort of set myself for this is that if we do find a village where we could potentially get uh, emeralds from by basically buying them from villagers then that uh, if i do find a village then i then to me i have to get I have to get diamonds to complete this challenge. Uh, sorry, emeralds to complete this challenge, basically. So that is a rule there. And as always, if I die in this challenge, then the challenge is over and I have failed, unfortunately. <laughs> so I've set myself for the ores, uh, required ores I need to get. I've set myself a goal of getting at least two of each um, ore. Now, obviously, things like... Um, so let's collect some of this, actually. Uh, ooh, we can actually make ourselves a bed. That will come in handy or, already. Um, yeah, things like coal and iron won't be too difficult, but uh, things like diamond and things might be um, a bit trickier. Actually, no, let's let's say three, actually. Just, you know, three's a good number. So, right, we need to get ourselves started. So I'm going to need a bunch of wood. Um... Ooh, so you, uh, this is this is handy. <laughs> oh, these wolves. <laughs> Thanks, mates. Where are you? <laughs> Where are you gone? Thank you, mates. You've helped me out here. Well, you just disappeared. Okay, right. Let's go and get a load of wood because we're going to need this sort of thing for creating sticks. And um, I don't think I need to create myself like a little hut house or anything like that. I think we can, you know, maybe just find a little cave and sort of box ourselves in if we really need to. Uh, but we need to, of course, make torches and things like that. Now, of course, I can use any any ores that I do collect. I can use them to make uh, better tools, you know, a sword, um, armor if needed. But, of course, I still need to get the required amount to um, complete the challenge. So, let's just get a bunch of wood here. Just... Yeah, just just so we've got plenty of it. You know, the more the merrier, basically. <laughs> uh, we want to be as quick as possible because we don't want it to become night time. Now, this could be a, a longest challenge. It may be over sort of two parts. I've not kind of set myself a goal of trying to do it in one video because, um, you know, it could take a while. I think in the, I've, I've, you know, in my head, I've got some kind of strategies of ways to do this best. I think. If we could ideally find like a cave, I think that's going to be a lot better for finding ore rather than... I don't want to strip mine. In fact, actually, um, you know, strip mine... I'm going to say strip mining is banned <laughs> just so I can't do it, basically. I don't... Because, you know, strip mining is just going to be something that's take ages. It's going to be essentially quite easy to do, but it's just going to be quite long-winded. And we don't want to be doing that in video, basically. So we've got to find a cave uh, so we can actually, you know 
so that the threat is real uh, when the monsters are coming after us. So, and that's why I've not given ourselves any sort of things because you know it means having to go down the cave specifically to go and get iron, uh, iron uh, ores and things like that. Uh, and you know we're gonna have monsters down there. So I didn't want to purposely give myself an iron sword or anything like that to give myself an advantage. This particular challenge. Those sorts of things are forbidden. So, right. Um, obviously, we haven't... Oh, I just thought, oh, where's that chest? Uh, I didn't pick up the torches. So, those would have come in handy. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no, don't tell me I've lost it. Um, I think it's... Oh, it's there. I can see it. Actually, I'll take the chest as well, because that will come in handy. Um, let's just take these torches. These will come good for starting us off. Um... Right. Ooh. <laughs> Look at these trees. Get out of my way. Uh, right, so we need to... Let's start off quickly by making ourselves a crafting table. What actually wood did we collect? Um, oh, spruce wood. I mean, it doesn't matter too much because anyone will do, basically. So we've got ourselves a crafting table. Um, I could do with making myself a pickaxe, really. Yeah, I definitely didn't get one. Uh, okay, let's have a wander. So I want to try and preserve the food as much as possible. Um, I have got some bits, like mutton and things, so I can get myself a furnace and do that. So what's this on? Is this going to be a cave or is it just going to be... No, it's just a little uh, bit under there. Mm, right, we need, really need to find a cave. Because, yeah, I don't want to... I mean, we can obviously do a bit of mining, like a bit of typical mining, just to, if we need to, but like, say, strip mining, literally just going, you know, in one direction um, is not allowed, basically. So, I wonder if we can find... It would be good if we could actually find a village. I know that's going to add an extra um, bit to the challenge, but it would be just handy if we could because we'll be able to find some more food and hopefully there might be a blacksmith chest or something like that. Uh, oh, let's... Um... Ooh, what am I doing? Ah! Chucking things away. <laughs> right, let's put some of this stuff away. Let's, make... let's put this crafting table down quickly and make a bed while we... Actually, let's just make a load of... Just so we're not messing around. Give ourselves a load of sticks as well. And made a bed, right. So it's going to get dark soon. Um, I really need... I think actually if we head... I just I just kind of want to find a village. Just purely because, like I said, there may be, you know, if there's a blacksmith in there, it could have something handy in there. Now, one thing I didn't mention actually, which uh, I should have done is if I do find anything, like for example in the bonus chest, if, if there's any iron in there, that wouldn't count basically. So right, we've got ourselves uh, some coal here and I realised I didn't make myself a pickaxe, did I? That's not very good. Um, <laughs> so let's just make ourselves a wood one for, for the time being. So let's collect this coal. Now of course I'm going to probably need to get more coal because... I'll need three pieces. Come on. <laughs> I forgot how uh, bad wood, uh, wood pickaxes are. They're so slow. So used to like at least stone. <laughs> but iron, of course, is very good. And of course, diamonds. Right, so we've got ourselves some... A little bit of coal there. So we can make some more torches. And who right. So we've got a little cave there. What I want to quickly do though is just head up on top of here. Just to. Is that like a cave? No, it's not a cave. Just to see if we can spot a village or anything like that. Um, nothing that I can see. I mean, there might not be one even generated in this world, to be honest. Um, but like I say, if we do come across one then we'll have to go to it because, um, yeah, I can't see anything. So, right, let's just head into 
yeah, let's just find that little cave thing that I found down here and head into there. And there's that some... No, it's not. I thought I saw some more coal then. Ooh, better get the torches out. Um, Put the sticks away. I want to try and preserve them as much as possible. Oh, and it's a dead end. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> Come on. Um, that's always the thing. It's like I'm always looking, like when I want to find a cave, I can never, never find one. Sometimes when I'm like building things, or in the past I've been building things, there's been like caves all over, and I think, oh, it's just going to be annoying. Like, And I try and fill it in as much as I can, just because it's a good area to build, and then it just turns out it's caves all over the place. I can't seem to see any more coal around here. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Come on. It's going to be a lot slower doing... There we go. Right, I just thought, actually, if we get some stone... Ah, see, it's getting dark. So let's get a little bit of stone. Um, so we're better... I mean, if we get in a cave, it's not going to matter if it's night time or not. It's just that, obviously, out in the open, you're going to get more things spawning. I heard the little cave sound, then. I believe it was a little cave sound. Um... No, there's nothing down there. Oh, see. We need to get indoors. We need to get out of the open, I think. Uh, right, there's a little... There's an opening there, and I can see some coal, so let's head there. I just need to hurry, because I just don't want things spawning. Um, I'm hoping that's going to be an actual sort of cave thing, but... It may not be. Oh, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure. Uh, actually, no. This look Oh, no. Oh, see. We've got a skeleton already. And uh, I should have made a sword. Oh, no. No. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm st see, if that skeleton wasn't there... I probably would have been all right. Um, ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. I'm stuck. I'm stuck for now. <laughs> right, let's just... Uh, let's eat. Eat, eat, eat. Oh, the skeleton. It's just gonna, I imagine it's just going to pop around the corner any any moment. Uh, come on. Right, we're gonna st we've got a sword anyway. Uh, I want my health to go up a bit more. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> oh, right, skeleton's down. Brilliant, oh dear. Okay, right, let's just pop a... T oh no, it's not even a proper cave. Uh, oh, that's really annoying. Okay, right, we're going to have to put this bed down here. Now, obviously, we can... Um, you know, if we die, it doesn't matter, you know, obviously about respawning, of course, so looks like there's not going to be anything in here worthwhile. So let's just collect this torch here and let's collect this crafting table. Um, need my axe to do that. Collect that. Right. Uh... Right, let's collect some of the coal again. I really, <laughs> I really thought we found a decent key there. I thought it was going to help us go down. Now, since it's daytime again, I think, because we're on some sort of hilly area, it might be worth heading over a bit further just to see if we can spot a village. Um, it would just be handy if we can get things like, ooh, there's another cave here. Anything? No. <laughs> it's just dead ends. course we've got to think about food as well because I mean when we're down in down in the mines there's not really going to be any food I mean we've got quite a bit on us I can make a furnace of course um, just to cook some of that mutton uh, ooh. you know you'd think there'd be like an entrance to a cave or something uh, I mean there's some up there but 
you know, if it's if it's high up, it's not going to be that beneficial because we've still got to go down. <laughs> so we really need to. Right, anything that we can see, anything at all, any villagers, a bunch of horses, no villagers that I can see. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, it's not a good start, to be honest. I mean, we've got some decent things from the um, the bonus chest, but, you know, we've got some coal. But we are going to need that for the torches. Um, we've got some more here, actually. I think what we'll do is... Actually, no, let's mine ourselves... Let's get some more cobblestone. And then we can just make ourselves some stone tools, at least. Ooh. <laughs> Right, mine all this. Come on. Let's get a load load of cobblestone. Got us yeah, we had a stone sword, didn't we? So that's fine. Um I've just why have I just crafted another crafting table? That was that was just silly. Ah dear. And yeah, we need to like cook the potatoes and things like that. So let's make a couple of these. Uh let's have a shovel as well, because we can do that. A bit ha uh, make it more handy. Uh, let's have another couple of swords. Let's just get rid of that wooden pickaxe. We don't need that now. Got some better ones, right? Let's just mine these. So we've got quite a lot of coal here. So this is handy. It's just about. I'm just thinking more about the torches because I think you know we're going to find a lot of coal down in the mines. It's just just how it is. Um, so I don't think we have to worry about that too much. But we just have to make sure, of course, we've got enough. <clears throat> and what I'll need to do as well, I think once I've collected everything, I'll need to display it. Uh, so I'll need to build myself a little wall. Um, you know, nothing too major. Just to display them. And I'll need, actually, item frames. Ooh! I can't, still can't see any sort of villages or anything like that. Um, yeah, that's really annoying. I'd really love to find a village, and it's not a massive world anyway. I've not got it. I've just got it on the kind of standard size rather than sort of large size. We don't really need that, you know, the massive worlds for when we're doing challenges. So I'm just collecting more coal here. <laughs> Anytime I see it, it's like I just think, you know, you. Coal is one of those things you can never have enough coal. You just you, you just can't have enough coal. <laughs> it's always useful. Furnaces, torches. It's all good. Uh, let's just get these last couple of bits here. Just cut a bit more cobblestone as well, just to uh, just so we've got a supply on us. I mean, we'll collect obviously loads when we're sort of down in. Down in the mines. I mean, finding something like a mine shaft would be awesome if we could do that. But, you know, they are quite rare. So, let's head up here. There's a lot of gravel here. And hopefully we've come to this peak here. Yeah, I am running out of food. Um... I don't think we're just not going to find... If there is a village, it's not anywhere nearby, as far as I can tell. Um, it's another quick wander over here. We need to find... Like I say, we need to find like a cave that's going to obviously go down. Um, it's going to... Yeah. I didn't think it would... You never know. It could have been... Yeah, take away the one gravel block, and the, if if they were able to fall, they'll fall down. Could have... You know, there could have been a big opening. Um... No, right. Can't waste any more time. We've got a, and that's the thing. If we need food, I guess if we see any animals, actually, we're just gonna have to um, take them out just to get as much food as we can. How much, you know, mutton we got? We got ten mutton. We got a couple of bones, actually. Maybe if I see, where's that wolf gone? Um. If we could t 
potentially... Hmm... Yeah, we got a dog. Yay! <laughs> so you can come with me. You can help protect me. Nice. It's always handy. And I can't think of an, a name. I can't think of a name for you. <laughs> um, let's call you... <laughs> let's call you Steve. Let's just name you after the uh, original Minecraft character. <laughs> Old Steve the dog. <laughs> First thing that popped in my head. And um, we've got a sheep here, so... It's just handy. I mean, obviously, go down in mines when there's lava and creepers and things like that is going to be dangerous. But you know, it's the it's the the risk we've got to take. Oh, we're not finding anything, and I'm running out of health very quickly. My hunger's well, sorry, my hunger's going right down very quickly. I really need to. I really want to find a village. I'm just set on finding one, but there's just not one around that I can see anywhere. Uh, okay, right. Let's go and gather some beef. So we could actually, if we get some leather, we could actually make ourselves a little bit of armor, you know, for that extra protection until we can get some decent. Um, Chicken. <laughs> I'm just I'm just collecting all as much of this stuff as I can. Just just while they're here. Sorry, cows, but I need you to survive. <laughs> and there's another dog down there. I don't think it's mine. Um, right. See, sometimes in these kind of plain areas, if you find just you know ravines and just random caves, holes in the ground just to go down. And I can't believe it. Like, there just don't seem to be anything around here. <laughs> it's normally the annoying case. And that's the thing as well. Because I'm on normal mode, the um, the hunger is going to go down very quickly. And I'm going to take more damage from uh, monsters as well. Oh, come on. Right. I can see some up there, actually. I think this is where we're going to have to give it a shot. What's this? No, it's just a little... Dip in the ground. Nothing, nothing that's going to help us. There is, oh, <laughs> nearly attacked my dog. Nearly attacked Steve the dog. Uh, right, and finally, let's just take out this cow. Now, is this going to go? Well, it's a zombie. It doesn't look like it's going to go anywhere, though, does it? Um. Okay, right. I mean, we've got zombies spawning, so, you know, there could actually be a zombie spawner. So. Oh, right. Oh, we've got some iron. Yes. Right. This is looking promising for getting ourselves going. So let's grab some of this iron quickly while it's here. Again, I mean, we could probably do with using the iron, at least for some tools, basically. Because we're going to, of course, need uh, to get diamonds. going to need um, an iron pickaxe to, mine, to be able to mine it okay yeah i'm thinking this is the way forward um now i want to make some torches while we're here there's probably a few things that i should get rid of um let's just get down in here uh doo -doo -doo -doo, let's put some of these things out where to oh, the torches are already there <laughs> It's just, it's just going back up again. Oh no, and there's a creeper. Ooh! <laughs> uh, I saw some iron, didn't I? Yeah. Let's grab this quickly. I've got to be really careful. I don't want like the creeper just deciding to just have a wander down here and come after me. Right, we've got plenty of iron. To get us going anyway. Uh, yeah, so we don't want to go up there. It's just going to lead back out again. So we need to. And yeah, it's getting like dark night time now. So. I don't know where that zombie is. The zombies aren't much of a threat, to be honest. They're not too bad. Um, let's just drop down. I'm just hoping it's not a dead end down here. Oh, and it looks like it is a dead end. 
Right, I think what we're going to need to do is... Oh, no. That's fine. I was thinking... Oh, there's a dead end here as well. <laughs> oh, this is so annoying. Oh, no. It is finding a way through. Right, so it looks like we're getting ourselves kind of set off all right in general. Nothing can... can oh, no, there's, there's nothing can get in, but the skeletons can shoot through, so... Oh, dog just... Oh. <laughs> I don't want him just dying. So let's grab some of this coal and things. Nope. Quickly. Oh no. I just heard the dog whine. Hopefully he's not dead. Oh no, I just didn't bark, he's fine. It's still alive. Oh, I don't like I don't like the side of the dog. Is is? I need to go rescue him. I don't know where he is. Right, oh, he's down there. Oh God. Um. Uh. 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 I don't know. Um. Uh, I'm. I'm. I'm stuck. I'm. I need him to spawn back over here or something. Come on, dog. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Whew. Whew. That was, that was uh, concerning. Uh, can I actually give him... Yeah, here we go. He's healed. Right. Whew. That was close. I mean, you know, I don't want the dog to die, of course. That's That would be terrible. So let's just pop... Um... Yeah, let's pop that there. So it looks like we're at the end of the out of time, unfortunately, guys. So, but yeah, we've made ourselves inside a cave. This looks promising. Looks like it's gonna go down to different parts. I can hear a zombie nearby as well. So, mm, so please do join me in part two while we can continue this challenge and try not to die. <laughs> and I need to build myself a furnace, of course. So, uh, please do like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more from me. But until next time in part two, I will see you all later, guys. Bye-bye.